please stop it, please, for God's sake, please stop it. There's no more time. You've got to, please, stop it, stop it now. Turn it off. Turn it off. Stop it. 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 Hey, yo. Welcome back to our channel. This is Chetty and Lycan's Horror Party Massacre. Um, we just finished watching here in our humble abode, Halloween Kills. Now, what did we think about Halloween Kills? Mm. Go ahead. Spoiler free, like him. Mm. 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 <laughs> uh, not the worst in the franchise, um, but oh my goddess. Terrible. Terrible, she says. Terrible. Terrible. I didn't think it was terrible. Uh, I'm going to be a little bit more specific, still remaining spoiler-free here. I, I liked that they tried to take it into a new direction with the crowd uh, going, starting a riot, basically, to hunt mm -hmm. him down. I thought that was an interesting concept. However... I like the old stuff better. I didn't like the concept <laughs> very much. It was cool to see it. But seeing it made me realize I like the old style horror stuff. I didn't really like the mob mentality thing that they went with. Um, I also thought that in this one, Michael was a lot more brutal in his kills. And he's never. That's not his style. Michael Myers has never been brutal. He's not cruel. And in this, he's cruel. Yeah. There was, I mean, the most... Brutally, he's been besides the Rob Zombie flicks is in uh, part six where he kills the Jamie Lloyd character. Right. Everything else is just stabby, stabby. Um, really, it's not that bad. Oh, Halloween... Believe it or not, uh, Jamie Lloyd's death in part six is my favorite kill. <laughs> Go figure. The one thing that really got me about this movie now, you, you know, that the crowd goes after him. There, there is one line spoken by one of the characters that is, oh, he always wears a mask. How do we know it's not him? Uh, he's been in a mental home for 40 fucking years. He hasn't had a mask on for 40 fucking years. I think you might know what he looks like. Yep. I could be wrong. Because in the last movie, um... They, the stupid little reporter came and gave and had the mask. Uh huh. So, yeah, he didn't have the mask while he was in the insane asylum. Come on, people. I don't know. I enjoyed it. I, I'm not going to say I didn't because I did. It just had for me a couple of issues. I did not like evil dies tonight like everybody else. You've read that all over the uh, Facebook, I'm sure. Um, I did not like the mob mentality aspect very much. I don't mind so much, you know, the survivors from part one going out and trying to hunt him down, but getting the whole town involved in it like that. And I mean, it was kind of excessive, too, because initially, in the original Halloween, he only killed like four people. I don't, yeah, he, he killed people, but I don't think four people would warrant that kind of response from the town. Four people 40 years ago. Four people, let's see, you had the three babysitter. Annie. Annie and PJ Souls and her boyfriend. Bob. And uh, the guy at the... Fuck. You know, I killed like four people. Four or five. But you are you killed the beloved neighborhood. Basically. No. Those girls didn't even live in that fucking neighborhood. I don't know. I just don't think that the the amount of kills that he did and the lack of brutality that he did with it, I don't think it would warrant that much of a response from the town. I don't think they would be so quick to go, let's hunt him down. Let's not let the police do their job. Because the police did their job pretty good several years ago. Well, <laughs> you know? In the original, I mean, Haddonfield Sheriff, you killed his daughter. So, I mean, yeah... The town is going to go after him. I don't agree. I don't think it, what he did warranted that much of a drastic response. But in any case, um, we enjoyed it. It's definitely worth going to see. We've waited over a year for this one to come out. It's supposed to come out last year, but that's fucking pandemic shit. Fucking pandemic shit. Yes. 
If you go check it out, tell us what you thought. Comment below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Do you want to see Evil Never Die? We'll talk to you next time. We'll talk to you. And don't stab me in the no-no spot. <laughs> no. Yeah, she we liked the part, the thing that the the guy from Mad TV was in it. We liked that. That was fun. Yeah. But all right, like, subscribe, share, care. Mm -hmm. That's bad juju. <laughs> That's the wrong movie. I don't care. <laughs> it's a better movie. Oh. I uh, I want to thank you. Anything you want, you. You just name it.